state. In the last few months, the various political parties have embarked on very rigorous campaigns to sell their respective candidates for the office of governor to the people of Edo State in an exercise which came to a climax yesterday. The attractive thing about democracy is the power it bestows on the people to choose who governs them. Therefore, when this power is blatantly seized from the people, it is not just a tragedy, but a travesty of democracy. Regrettably, the outcome of the September 21st governorship election appears to have daunted the spirit of many Edo people who feel powerless in the face of the brute force of the institutions that are supposed to protect them. It is therefore understandable that many people feel sad and aggrieved. But in the midst of this despair, I'm urging all my fellow Edo citizens to maintain calm and not resort to violence and the destruction of property in spite of this provocation. Peace and justice will always win at the end, and this is my prescription to all the good people of Edo State who feel vexed and violated at this time. Clearly, it is obvious to the least discerning the amount of impunity and reckless disregard for processes and law that was displayed in this gubernatorial election. In a democracy, there are always safeguards for addressing grievances, and we hope that all those affected will seek resolution for this blatant disregard of law and process. With this in mind, I implore all Edo people to go about their lawful businesses and rest assured of the commitment of our government to your well-being and security. God bless the people of Edo State. God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I have tried.